besties hello and welcome back to another incredible vlog this is basically me first week of uni having a breakdown all of those kind of cool girly things and also this morning i tried to have cereal for breakfast didn't want it no one likes cereal toast is obviously superior and i didn't have any soy milk so that was a really great time Good morning besties it's monday i'm not thriving i haven't washed my face yet my face hurts my brain hurts, my soul hurts. Also, as you would have just seen, I was gonna make some cereal, and I make some cereal. But I've got like that much soy milk left and I'm not going shopping till tomorrow, so yeah, that's not happening. I've also not washed my hair, so that's just, yeah, you're welcome. But I have, today I have tutoring at 11, a lecture at two till four, and then four till five. I think and then I'm probably gonna go to the gym because I normally go to the gym on Monday morning but I can't do that because I actually have to go to uni so I'll go to the gym at like six I don't know um not excited for uni not excited for life but that's just how it is sometimes you just have to suffer to get a degree life is suffering oh also I painted my nails yesterday you can't really see them, my hands look massive. Am I insecure? Kind of. Um, but I just paint them brown and then that top it on. If you have a gel lamp and you have really low quality um, gel nail polishes, if you get a matte top coat, they all become invincible. Like, with a, a shiny one, I'm, just, I'm chipping it off and it's falling off all the time, but matte, no bestie, she's fine. So then I had tutoring, which I was doing A-level psychology. We did some research methods, which I always quite like doing. I think research methods is quite easy and I quite like it. And it's always relevant in uni. Like it's never something you don't need to know. It's always quite useful. Um, and I was feeling fine during this tutoring. And then shortly after <laughs> the stress began because uni's terrifying. But yeah, I actually do really enjoy my tutoring. I'm not gonna lie is, I mean, it's the highlight of my week, but also one of the most terrifying parts of my week like I really like my Monday because I don't really do anything but Tuesdays really stress me out because I have between three and four lessons directly in a row and that does not tickle my pickle I just don't think this is like great for me. I don't want to do it. I want to go home. Like I can't take the pressure of it. But don't you think any job interview? I think having a breakdown. Um, yeah, lecture time. Top, she in. Trousers, she in. Trainers, charity shop. Oh, I'm so hungry. This is two o'clock lecture, but I can't eat because it's little. It's time, it's time to go. Have a right down. Let's do it for the vlog. There we go. Uni's boring. I'm stuck. We just got back. Um, so our first lecture was two till four. It was not two till four, it was two till three fifteen. Useless. Don't like lectures. Oh I went to prep first because I got a prep subscription, a free trial a month. Obviously I'm not paying for it. And I got smoothie before. It was I'm not a big smoothie girl, but I didn't want a coffee because it's too late, it was like 2 p.m. Um, then we went to our second lecture, which was 4 till 5, but it was, it was not 4 till 5 again, it was um, it was 4 until 4.30. And then we finished, and then we went to Sainsbury's and got, I got some tofu. Because I'm boring, but I have friends, um, so that was nice. I walked back with people, um, I'm going to the gym now because it's, five o'clock, so hopefully there's not, well it's not, it's like now six o'clock, but like hopefully there's not too many of the gym lads that we there like, <laughs> and do the disgusting grunt. Um, but yeah, gym time. It can't wait another day. Don't feel like it's all Hey besties, welcome to Tuesday. If you ever just see this, attached to my outfit so that's just how it is. Yesterday for my lecture I attached it to the um, my lanyard but I just 
like when I go to the gym and I need to like refix my hair and it's just like that's touching like that's got my skin in it but yeah claw clips are great yeah welcome to Tuesday I got no lectures today well I don't really have one actually I'm not going to it I technically have something at 12 to 1 with my tutor but I emailed to swap tutors because I yeah wasn't vibing wasn't for me and my, my timetable never changed so I just don't have that lecture. Well, I still have technically the lecture with my old tutor, but I'm not gonna go to the lecture with my old tutor when I don't have them anymore. Because that would like, I'd just rock up and be like, hi, I changed tutors. I had issues with this group. Thanks. Um, so yeah, not going to that. Um, I don't think it's useful though. I literally, it's like, it's called like careers advice. But because I've never met my tutor in person, I would assume it would literally just be like, oh, hi. Nice to meet you. How did you find first year? How are you finding second year? That kind of rubbish. So I'm just going to ask someone else who isn't in my tutor group just what they do in the careers advice thing because it seems useless. But that means I have today free, which means I'm going to Wilco. If you know, Wilco is a thing. I've been waiting to go to Wilco for a very long time. I need plastic wallets. Are most important. I can only use Wilco plastic wallets. They're the only ones that work for me. But the Wilco's kind of far away. It's not far away. It's just in an inconvenient location. And I had a Wilco voucher, or a Love to Shop voucher, but so I wasn't going to go to Wilco and not use the Love to Shop voucher, but it took over a week to get here, and that was not for me. But I also have to find... I also have to buy paper, but that's kind of a distance to carry print paper. So I'm probably just going to buy printed paper somewhere else because I don't have a free anyway because disabled students allowance, free paper. Well I have like a printed paper allowance, ink allowance. So just next time I need paper I'll just buy it and then send the receipt and then I get the money back. So free paper. And then I don't really need anything else more from Wilco but I do have like, I think I have £11.67 or something like that left. So I'm just going to spend my money and I'm also going to I'm gonna, because I basically, to get to the city, I don't have a bus pass, I'm not paying for the bus pass because I thought of £300 coming out at once, disgusting. Um, but like, so I scoot, but the only way to scoot is to basically die. So I have to put my hair in a little, a little colonial thing. heads. I don't know why they were on sale. They were £1.50 but our current dishmatic head is um, vulgar you could say. This is the best deodorant to ever exist as a fact. Um, I've already got one bottle but it's so good. I had to get a second one. They were £1.50 which is cheap considering it's supposed to be like £3. I'm not paying £3 for deodorant but £1.50 when it's free. We've got two more things for the main event. I got, I was gonna get this before I went to uni, but I was like, I don't understand it. I got a scrub bar. Like, it's like a soap bar, but with bits. It smells good. It's like wrapped in cling film. We'll give it a go. It was one pound, but it was also free. Next thing I got was a hair mask. I was gonna get, they had like fancy shampoo and conditioner, and I buy cheap, crap shampoo and conditioner because I don't care but I feel like a hair mask is a good shout because I can just buy really low quality shampoo and conditioner and an okay quality hair mask will fix that it smells alright it's for smooth and sleek hair for keratin reconstruction after 72 hours of smooth and shiny hair which is good because I wash my hair every 72 hours the main event And not just any. Wilco. And not just one. Three. 
So I have 150 plastic wallets now. Life is good. I'm feeling happy. I got them. I'm very happy now. Hopefully this is enough. I was only gonna get two and then I was like, you know what? I love them all because kind of far away, so I'll get three. That's my haul, that's £10.50, but free with my vouchers. So yeah, then I went to Aldi and I I spent, I think, £19, £3 of that was um, toilet paper, always a fun shout. Then I just unpacked all my stuff, spoke to my flatmate, hi Jade, bestie, miss you. And then I basically just sat on my bed and went through all of my uni notes and put them in actual plastic wallets and separated them because I now have so many plastic wallets. Tutoring time, I have two directly in a row, 15 minute break, then another one. Um, So yeah, then I had triple tutoring and I did biopsychology for an hour, psychopathology for an hour, and then photosynthesis for an hour. And then it was time for dinner and bed. Been thinking we could talk it out, you make me forget what we threw in this song. There might be a little dry shampoo on my head, so let's just... I don't know if there is. I can't tell. That looks lighter. But is that just my hair? I don't know. Um, but yeah, I am. I am going to breakfast in 10 minutes. I haven't been to breakfast with anyone. I've never really had friends though, so this is a new experience for everyone. Um, but I'm, I'm going to breakfast while my, my, my little Jane is in a 9am research methods. Not thriving, I'm glad I don't have a 9am research methods, but mine is 4pm on a Friday. Like, I finished my week with research methods, which, yeah, not a fan, but it does mean I can use the whole week to prep for research methods, because everything else doesn't really need prep. But research methods, I'm just not quite, I'm not quite there yet. I'm not quite on it. Um, but yeah, I'm going for breakfast. I don't know what I'm going to get. I'm a massive breakfast person, as in I need breakfast to function. Which makes me think, why am I going out for breakfast? Because I'm currently starving. I woke up at 9 o'clock, and we're going at 10, and I'm so hungry. Then I'm going to go to the gym, and then on the way back from the gym, I might get prep, because I've still got my prep subscription. Then I've got two tutoring, and then it's time to wash my hair. I've just seen a cat. This is what I love. I sit here and I film, and there's perfect kitty content. She's far away, but she's beautiful. No one asked, OOTD. This is the new one I was wearing yesterday, which I really quite like. I don't know, that just really tickles my pickle. Um, Mango, but charity shop. These are H&M, but charity shop. Um, so, let me, this is, this is the fit, but without shoes. Wow. Yesterday, this is fun. Today I am sat on my chair, which is already really low quality, and it did in fact snap. So, why do landlords give us like plastic primary school chairs? It snapped with just my body weight. I'm not gonna lie, I would not say I'm particularly large. 
how did anyone sit on this chair and not break it before? I literally just sat down, leant at the back, which is how you sit on a chair, and it just snapped and I fell off. So I did email the landlord and be like, hi, do I get a replacement? Do I have to buy a replacement? Like, I don't know how that works, but hopefully they'll just replace it with a chair that's maybe not, not as bad, but who knows. Um, yesterday I just gave up filming. Um, I think I, I gave up filming after I went to Pret. Um, but all I did was I walked back with my prep, quite a nice prep. I got a soy ice mocha, but they didn't mix it very well. So I did get a lot of just coffee granules, which were quite gritty. Then I had two tutoring sessions, but I was like, I'm not gonna film them because it would just make the video longer. It would just be time lapse of me going like that. Oh, then. So, you will have seen in one of my last videos I got monetized. Thanks besties. It's actually quite a difficult process. Not the getting monetized, like I, that's, that's fine. But the monetizing your channel. Because I had to go through, I have 90 videos. I had to go through and individually turn monetization on for all of them. And then I realized I have loads of copyright claims just randomly sat on my channel for things that are not a copyright claim. So I had to go through and dispute all of those. So now I have to wait for them to come through. And I, some of my videos, YouTube automatically put ads on, like it put the mid-roll ad breaks in. Some of them it didn't. Like I clicked on one of my Barbie videos and it automatically put like 30 ads on. I was like, I know it's an hour long, but 30 ads, quite a few. So then I had to go through and delete loads of ads. And then I had to individually, manually place ads on 90 videos. But now, still when I go back and look at my videos, some of the ads are, not ads that I've placed there, they're just random ads. Because I was watching my videos to see if I can get the ads and where they come up. But like some of my videos, I put an ad like every eight minutes. Um, apart from my Barbie one, I put more on that because here's what I did, right? I don't care, if you, if you disagree, that's fine. But like I found my more popular videos and I just put a few more ads on those because I was like, I don't really know how monetization works, don't know how much money I'm gonna get, but like, I'm just testing my theory. So I was like, which of my videos are currently gaining views? And then I put a few more ads on them to see how it compares essentially. But yeah, if you do wanna watch my videos, please turn ad block off um, and don't skip the ads. And if you want, just put my videos on in the background and just leave them running with ad block off. I don't know how much money I'm gonna get from YouTube. I don't really care if I make money, I'm not gonna lie, but I wanna see how it works. Um, I've only been monetized for like, one day actively um so yeah who knows how it's gonna go i'm feeling kind of cute though but i have i have a lecture at four o'clock until five o'clock and that's it for today so i think i'm gonna film a youtube video um i think i'm gonna film a what's in my uni bag which isn't that exciting because i've been to uni one time but still it's how it will be and also i might film it wearing this because i feel a little bit i don't know why but this is kind of feeling cute feel quite pretty. From Specsavers. Yeah, that's not too exciting. I just, oh, I can't see. I feel like I look so much prettier with my glasses on. Am I even in focus? Yeah, I just, I take my glasses. That's not particularly exciting. So yeah, then I got a prep. I got a soy iced chocolate, I think, and I was actually kind of all right. If they had mixed it, it would have been nicer. And then I had a language and memory lecture, which was actually kind of Good. like it was more like what I thought a lecture would be when they actually teach you content rather than just being like this is the content you should have learned um and then I got another prep because we got out before it closed so I treated myself because it was free right besties it's Friday we have Language and memory for an hour. Yay. This is my beautiful outfit. <gasps> Cat. Yeah, this is my lovely outfit with my really great slippers. Um, and I have a cold. Um, and I have anxiety, so bye bye.
car running in line for the lap around Drop everything and catch me before gravity do Been through so much we don't gotta make a sound Well look we know what the call will be you might be able to hear my neighbors being really nice and annoying. They like to play really loud music or leaving their door open. And there's never we can stop the sound coming in. So that's really fun. Um, but yeah, it's Friday. Finished with uni for the week. Finished with everything for the week, actually. Um, the only thing I've got tomorrow with netball and then I've got work and tutoring. Um, so that is my week in the life. That is. I guess what I do at uni, um, it's not much, I know that, like, compared to other uni students that go in, well, they actually have uni, I have uni three days a week, and I've had one, two, three, I've had five in-person things this week, I was supposed to have six, but that one just never happened, so, that's done, week is finished, I had lots of free prep, not many lectures, a little bit of tutoring. And that's about it. Stats is done for But yeah, that's it. Um, I'm probably gonna do more of these because they're quite easy to film. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed it and it was nice to watch. That is the end of the video. You know, subscribe, like, thumbs up, all that YouTube barista. <laughs>